Hello Virgo, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading and it's going to be focused on the general energies for you. I'm going to be looking at your energy, what's going on in your career, your finances, blessings coming in, advice as well. I'm also going to pull one card for romance for those of you that are interested and there's going to be an extended reading. So if you are interested in that, you can find the link in the description box below. Let's see what's going on in Virgo's world, general energies. Let's have a look at your energy. Right, very first card. I feel like for some of you, there's a lot of things that are hidden in obscurity. There's a lot of energies here which you don't really see. You can't really understand at this point in time. Some of you are feeling in the dark. There's this element of not really knowing whether you should follow your instinct or you should go about things in terms of how you usually do things. So this is a little bit of confusion, I feel, because I feel like this card is linked to the fact that some of you have your heads in the clouds, you want certain things to go in a certain direction, but you really don't know uh, how it's going to pan out. So there's a bit of obscurity there. It feels like you're trying to make your way uh, through a situation that has a little bit of... Uh, cause a little bit of uh, confusion. It could be confounding you at this point in time. Let's see what's happening in your career. I will clarify this card in a moment, right? Right, I feel like there's a new beginning on the horizon for your career and you might be feeling like, you know, this is something you want to do, you feel a lot of passion towards it, you feel a great deal of excitement towards it, it is going to provide you with a sense of joy, that's how you are looking at the situation, you're very very much anticipating it with a lot of excitement, a lot of eagerness, a lot of joy. It feels like the kind of energy where you're ready to see what comes of it. So I feel like, you know, there's fear, but there's also a sense of excitement that's showing up in your energy at this time. Remember, this is a general tarot card reading. Okay, your finances. I feel like you're looking for ways to improve your finances at this point in time. For some of you, I feel like there's an energy of not really knowing, um, uh, perhaps uh, some of you have a lot of money stashed away and you're keeping quiet about it because that could be giving me an indication of that. But I feel like you're analyzing your finances and asking yourself, are you where you want to be at this point in time? Right. Let's clarify this cause. Right, I feel like there's confusion here as a result of some sort of conflict. There's some sort of fighting that is happening in the situation. And I feel like it's making you feel a little bit uncertain, right? There's uh, something going on in your world that's bringing a bit of drama, bringing uh, a situation where you're not seeing eye to eye with certain people around you. But I feel like, you know, you're excited and exuberant about this new opportunity. But at the same time, I feel like, you know, uh, you're in deep thought when it comes to the choices you've made, when it comes to your career, your finances, things of that sort, which is very interesting. It's almost like there's a new opportunity there, but you don't know if you should share this new opportunity. It's like the choices you are about to make at this point in time could cause a lot of people to disagree with you or a lot of people to not be happy 
about the path you're taking. It feels like that kind of energy. But I feel like you're wanting to do what makes you feel a sense of happiness. You're wanting to go towards your sense of joy at the end of the day. Let's see what blessings are coming in for you, Virgo. It just feels like you're making a decision. And certain people are not sure about the decision you're making, but this is allowing you to step into your leadership abilities. This is allowing you to create something that's very different for yourself. And people are afraid for you, but I feel like you're very brave in your desire to go about what it is you need to do right now. So I'm getting that very heavily from these energies. What is the advice here? I feel like you have a leadership ability or leadership opportunity coming up. The advice is to really study everything, to really figure things out, to really know everything you're dealing with. Let's take a look at this uh, leadership ability or leadership responsibility coming forth. This is going to give you an opportunity to create happiness. Very fast happiness is going to be coming forth in your experience, right? It feels as if you're going to have something worth holding on to. It's going to bring you a lot of joy and celebration. It's going to bring you a lot of excitement as well. It feels like you're going to be celebrating very soon. So whatever that might mean, it, it could mean that you're making the right decisions, but you're also backing it up with knowing that you're on the right path, with choosing the right decision, choosing the right um, uh, way going forward. I feel like those energies are coming forth very heavily. Let's get some clarity. Yeah, I feel like there's an instance of you uh, potentially being very smart about the decisions and moving towards your destiny. I feel like these cards are coming out in that light, right? It feels like you have to outmaneuver certain things. There's certain obstacles. They're not really obstacles. They're very minute. You might think that they are, but they don't really have any um, relevance in your world. It feels like the kind of energy where you are you know, analyzing the pros and the cons. There's a lot of pros for you to go in one direction versus another. And you're feeling that pull, you're feeling that desire. So I feel like what Spirit is indicating here from these particular cards is that you have to be very smart about getting out of the situation you're currently in and you will find your way out of it. Let's get one card for romance. Right. I feel like when it comes to romance, there's an opportunity of being presented to you, um, important communication, a communication that might be relevant to you coming forth. I'm getting the impression here yeah, that there might be something that needs to be said by you or by someone else. It could be a very, you know, uh, critical to your relationship at this moment in time. So this energy is giving me the impression here of uh, something important being discussed, especially with the way that these cards have come out. It might be that you may need to discuss some important aspect with this person that you're dealing with or whatever uh, surrounding the choices you're making at this point in time. It might be relevant to, to you in some instances. I'm also getting the impression of some sort of... Um, you know, thing that has been on your mind for some time and you want to get it off your chest or someone wanting to get it off their chest with this particular card. So uh, there's a build-up in terms of this energy. There's a build-up in terms of what it presents to you or this individual concern. And it does have um, a lot to, um, you know, offer in terms of uh, your romantic world. This could be new communication coming in. From a new person, this could be communication from the person you're currently dealing with. Right. So what I'm going to explore in the extended is what is this communication? I'm going to look at the possibility of new love as well as the possibility of the 
person that you're currently dealing with to see how it all plays out or how it all pans out between you and whatever it is that you have going on at this point in time, right? I'll see what this conversation could potentially be, what it's going to lead to, what it's going to bring as a result, etc. and any advice uh, going forth for you guys. So I hope you guys have enjoyed your tarot card reading. I hope it has provided you with clarity and peace of mind. If you're interested in other additional readings, you can check out the exclusive readings that are on the tarotempress.com. Uh, as of yet, I haven't been, you know, checking my uh, communication, my emails and things of that sort. Um, I will get to it maybe end of this week or beginning of next week, etc. And the personal reading should be open up. I'm not sure when, but uh, whenever I feel like uh, the time is right. So have a wonderful day and take care.